Welcome back everyone, my name is Cezento and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video and today I actually wanted to go ahead and show you a very very simple fix to the mouse input lag for PC. Now if you guys don't know what that is or if you're just coming by and you're trying to find out how to fix it or anything like that, um, what it is is whenever you're in game, it, for some for whatever reason, um, the mouse actually doesn't seem very like when you're actually aiming in or doing stuff, it seems really really odd and it's very off and it's not as responsive as it should, should be. Um, in Black Ops 2, if you've played any previous COD, you know, you realize that it's very very responsive and for whatever reason, this game has a very bad input lag problem so today I'm actually going to be going ahead and showing you how to fix that with um, multiple steps that you don't necessarily have to do however I do recommend highly to go ahead and get that so the first thing you want to go ahead and do is hit menu uh, go to your options tab and we're actually looking at the controls first so what you want to make sure you have off uh, is actually frame smoothing. Now this might be on, um, for me it wasn't, but you definitely do want this off and make sure that it's completely, uh, you know, it's not uh, done because it, it will kind of mess up with your frame rate and it does, it has led to some problems of, uh, you know, that mouse input lag. Now, uh, in, in inverted mouse doesn't matter if it looks fine, uh, mouse sensitivity, whatever. Now what's really important here is that the mouse acceleration is off. Now it should come default that this is actually off, um, both of these, which you really need um, all the way down to zero. Um, I'm pretty sure that the default is actually like this but I do realize that sometime if you're you know doing your mouse sensitivity you might accidentally bump it to say like 50 so like say you're putting it all the way up here you accidentally go to close out, or close out and you accidentally click it like that and it'll not even like do it. So you want to go ahead and make sure that's completely off along with the mouse filtering. So once you're done with that you go ahead and uh, it's, everything's fine uh, you actually want to go next to your graphics. Now this is a very very important um, step uh, you have to have one. Um, I really do suggest that you have all those steps in the actual mouse configuration. But a guaranteed fix that you can do um, with this as well is also the render resolution. So pretty much, if you don't know what it is, um, when your computer or when you're uh, actually rendering stuff, um, it's actually doing it at a certain resolution. And that's what gives things more depth um, to the actual image. So um, typically, is at 1920 by 1080 unless you have a monitor or something that um, automatically limits that. So. Um, a guaranteed fix for this is actually just lowering it by like 10%. Uh, maybe if you really, really want to make sure that's gone, go ahead and put it at 80, uh, and that is a guaranteed fix um, for it, and that reduces a huge amount of the input lag. Now for myself, I can't exactly do that because I record videos. So in order for me to actually uh, get this working, um, I can't. I have to have it at 1920 by 1080 in order to post to YouTube. And sadly, there is no 12. Uh, uh, 1280 by 720 on here, so I had kind of been forced to use uh, 1080 or 100 percent render resolution. Um, but as for you guys that can, I'd really just recommend that. Um, it's very very simple and extremely easy fix. Now the second thing I do want to talk about is actually the max frames per second. So what you actually have for this is whatever your monitor is or the refresh rate um, on the actual monitor. Um, for example, mine is 144 hertz, so it should automatically be set to whatever your um, monitor's refresh rate is. So, example, mine's 144. You know, yours might be 120 or even possibly 60, uh, maybe even 90. I think is something, but it'll automatically be set to that. So, mine was set at 144. And all you have to do is this is really, really simple, and it actually helped me fix it uh, quite easily. So, all I had to do is pretty much drop it by like that much drop it by about 10 um, I have the luxury of being able to drop it you know however however many I want because I do have a very high uh, refresh rate um, and you know you just have to drop it by like 10 and personally I like to make sure that it's gone so I just put it to like 120 that's dropping it a good 20 frames now for those of you who actually do have 60 and you don't have that luxury of being able to drop it by you know that 20 frames per second without it making a huge difference um, say it's at 60, I heard that if you actually put it to 58, that should get rid of most of the input lag. Um, if you want to go 55, it'll also work. But really, it's just lowering the max uh, frame rate. And for whatever reason, this just really, really helps and is extremely nice to have. So, uh, if you, of course, you can't have the render resolution uh, down. You can also put this high or, or this lowered as well. And second of all, you want to go ahead and, uh, or also, you want to make sure that your uh, singular frame is completely off because um, it it tends to cap your FPS and uh, I have noticed that when I had this on um, I was just ex kind of experimenting with it it actually did to it did lead to a little bit of uh, mouse input as or in mouse input lag as well so if you guys go ahead and do all those steps um, like I said follow it's very very simple and of course uh, you know it'll get rid of the input lag and if, ever since I've been doing this or you know I've been actually using this I have noticed that uh, there's a huge huge difference of my mouse actually being very responsive uh, and working extremely well so if you guys did enjoy this video um, or it, it helped you please hit that like button it really does help me or also tell me in the comment section below um, and of course like I said you don't have to do all the steps however they're highly recommended 
um, and it works perfectly fine. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video and it helped you guys out a lot. So thank you all so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys all later. Peace out.